Jackie, why is that girl so sad? Huh, let's go see, Jax. Hello. What's your name? Why do you look so sad? I am Melina. I make handmade slippers for people. Oh, well, that's nice. What seems to be the problem, Melina? So I look at customers' feet and make slippers for them accordingly. But they never seem to fit. They are either too tight or too loose. I don't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, don't cry. I am sure we can figure out the problem together. Y'all will help me? Sure, we love to help people. Oh, that's so nice of y'all. Okay, kids, we must help Melina make the right size slippers for people. Hmm, we know measurement. Can't we use something to compare? That is actually a good idea, Jax. We can use something small to measure someone's foot. Huh. Oh, Melina, can you give me your hair clip? Um, okay. I think we can use this. You remember how we can measure things using hand span, foot span, and finger span, right? Well, we can use day-to-day -day objects to do the same as well, like this hair clip. Let's give it a try. Hey, do you have a pair of slippers my size? We most certainly do, mister. But can I have a look at your current slippers to check the size? All right, let's measure this. Three, four, five, Six hair clips. Melina, would you please make a pair of slippers that are exactly six hairpins in length? All done. Let's check if it fits. Wow, they fit so well. Wonderful. Thank you. Oh, I think I need my hair clip back now. But then how will we measure the material, DT? Well, we can use other things lying here, like an eraser or a pencil. But this is perfect for measuring. Look at it closely. Can you see how there are marks on it at exactly the same distance from each other? Well. This fixed distance is exactly one inch. And this particular ruler has 10 inches. Now, we can always use different objects like hair clips, but that's not a good way of measuring since different people would have different sized hair clips. Thus, we use a customary unit such as an inch. Um, Dee Dee, I have tried to use a foot ruler before, but you see, my cousins have moved to another country. Whenever I tell them inches, they get confused. Oh, Melina, inch is a customary unit, which means that it is not used in all the countries around the world. Which means whenever you talk to your cousins, you should use a standard unit, such as a centimeter, something used all over the world. Standard unit? Yes, Jax, standard units. So you see, Melina, we know that you can measure lengths in meters, centimeters, yards, miles, inches, and feet. But if everyone kept using their own units, how would they know the exact length of when they talked to someone else? So people of different countries decided that even if they have different customary units, they will use the same standard units to measure lengths. Centimeters, meters, and kilometers are the standard units of length. Um, okay. Uh, I know that 100 centimeters make one meter, and 1,000 meters make a kilometer. Stars and galaxies, Jane, you do remember everything perfectly. Well done. 
Okay, so Melina, basically a centimeter scale is what you need for your cousins. 